mystery of stuff. Geneticists to understand why children are expected to resemble their parents. Even long before DNA was discovered, people knew that kids would take after their mom and dad in some ways. That's just as true for animals as it is for humans. Which is why Rosie the Rescue Dog story is such a strange one. Thankfully, her owners were there to witness the moment when she gave birth to some very unusual puppies. Meet Rosie the Rescue Dog. Almost as soon as she was taken to the country shelter where she was surrendered, it was clear that she was in desperate need of all the help she could get. That's because Rosie was pregnant, and she was quite far along at that. Luckily, as a Golden Retriever mix, she was able to be taken in by the staff at Noose River Golden Retriever Rescue, which is based in Raleigh, North Carolina. After a few other foster candidates offered Rosie a temporary home, she was eventually taken in by John and Katie Black. The couple had fostered more than 20 dogs over the course of the past eight years. John and Katie were more than prepared to support Rosie's upcoming new family, but they could have never expected what they'd find once she actually gave birth to her puppies. After all, Rosie's puppies, adorable and healthy as they may have been, looked almost nothing like their mama. How could a golden retriever give birth to offspring that looked so strange? Not quite what we were expecting, Katie wrote when she shared her unusual story on Reddit. Our foster dog and golden mix gave birth yesterday to baby cows. She's one proud mama. Fellow Redditors couldn't help but be amused by this particular photo that Katie shared, not only because of the stark contrast between the youngsters and their mother, but Rosie wore the most confused look on her face. That picture received more than 90,000 upvotes and counting, and it was no wonder. Rosie was probably thinking, yeah, I know, they take after their father. Still, Rosie seemed eager and happy to take care of her babies as best she possibly could. The puppies all bore adorably inspired names, too. Daisy, Betsy, Clarabelle, and of course, Moo. Nobody could tell what kind of dog their father was, but it was safe to say that he was not a golden retriever. As Rosie continued to nurse the puppies and make sure they were growing up strong and healthy, she could find solace in knowing that her little family would all stay with the Blacks until the pups were ready to be sent into their brand new forever homes. Sometimes when you see pups like Rosie, it almost feels like dogs come in more shapes and sizes than any other species on the planet. Of course, humans have a big hand in this as we've bred them that way for thousands of years. During most of history, purebreds were the peak of canine sophistication. But recently, certain mixed breed dogs have started taking over. It's as if everywhere you look, there's a new breed on the rise that everyone can't stop talking about. Pitsky, a mix between a pit bull and a husky. These dogs are perfect for anyone who loves huskies, but lives in a warmer climate. Not only do they have a beautiful look, but their hair is short, meaning less grooming for you. Golden Husky, a mix of Golden Retriever and a Husky. It's easy to see why anyone could easily fall in love with these little guys. Just look at those bright eyes. You're not going to find many everyday retrievers with baby blues like that. Corgi Poo, a cross between a toy poodle and a corgi. These little fellas have similar body structure to corgis, though their fur more closely resembles that of a poodle. They're also noted for their roundish faces and their floppy ears. Basset Pei, a mix of a Basset Hound and a Sharpei. These undeniably unique dogs are sure to grab your attention. These pups are regarded for their often playful demeanor that can easily transform into a protective nature too. Shorgi, a cross between a corgi and a Sheltie. Like corgis, these little guys have a curious and adventurous nature, but they can also be rather efficient herders, too. As descendants of Shelties, it's in their blood, after all. German Chow A mix of a Chow Chow and a German Shepherd. These loyal dogs are definitely little, mid-sized balls of energy. When you least expect it, they'll come up to you and beg you to pay attention to them. Schnoodle A hybrid of a Schnauzer and a Poodle. These pups are known for their protective demeanors. Completely obedient to their owners, they often think they're bigger than they are and go after any potential threats. Bullpug. As a hybrid of the English Bulldog and a Pug, these dogs are regarded for their incredibly strong bodies. While Bulldogs were originally bred to catch bulls, really, you won't find this hybrid doing much more than lounging around and relaxing. 
Seborgi, a mix between a Siberian Husky and a Corgi. These beautiful dogs are known for their adventurous spirit as well as their affinity to go on long walks with their humans. But don't look at them as a watchdog. They don't have an aggressive bone in their bodies. Bulldog Shepherd, a hybrid of the English Bulldog and the German Shepherd. These dogs are known to be shedders. But if you don't mind grooming, then you're in for a real treat because they're especially loyal companions to their humans. German Pei. This is a mix between a German Shepherd and a Sharpei. Not only do these big guys make great watchdogs, but they're also loyal companions who like to kick back and enjoy a relaxing night with their humans. Pomsky. People can't help but fawn over this hybrid of a Pomeranian and a Husky. It's safe to say if you have an affinity for the look of a Husky but the temperament and size of a Pomeranian, then this is the pup for you. Cocker Pay. Those looking for a loyal pup should check out the hybrid of Sharpe and Cocker Spaniel. Furthermore, they get along great with other pets. The more the merrier. German Beagle. Even though Germans in the name of this mix between a Beagle and a German Shepherd, don't be fooled, they're not of German descent whatsoever. They are, however, noted for their playful and loyal demeanor. Yorkie Poo. People can't help but compare the hybrid of a Yorkshire Terrier and a Poodle to the Ewoks from Star Wars Episode 6, Return of the Jedi. Just look at that scruffy head of fur and adorable face. What's not to love, right? Shaporgi. This hybrid of a German Shepherd and a Corgi might not be the most well-known crossbreed in the bunch, but rest assured, they're every bit as loving and devoted to their humans as any other breed. Chug. As one might expect, the cross between a Pug and a Chihuahua can produce wildly different results. Some owners have claimed they're extremely relaxed and playful, while others mention they're energetic and loud. Dashation. Just look at the floppy ears on this hybrid between a Dalmatian and a Dachshund. Not only are they undeniably adorable, but they're loyal to their humans and they just love to play. Chusky. It should go without saying, but if you walk down the street with this fluffy cross between a Chow Chow and a Husky, you're going to get some funny looks from strangers. They may look like bears, but they're much friendlier. Del Corgi. You'll be seeing spots everywhere with this mix between a Corgi and a Dalmatian. If you love the look of Dalmatians but prefer the size of a Corgi, then you've found your next pup. Golden Dachshund Can you think of a more friendly and inviting crossbreed than that of a Golden Retriever and a Dachshund? Go ahead and try, but you're not going to think of one. They're so sweet. Cheagle would you just look at the ears on this mix between a Chihuahua and a Beagle? Can't you just imagine those flopping all around while this little guy trots around your home? That's what dog dreams are.